Hey, Dev. Your car's here. Hey, man. Need any help? Uh, still gotta do the dishes. Oh, I'll do that. You got bigger fish to fry. Namely, being on live TV tonight. <laughs> <laughs> man, don't remind me. You kidding? You're Devin Wade. You're gonna be better than the best, man. Trust me. <laughs> Thanks, man. What they got you doing out there, anyway? I don't know. Well, I guess they'll probably have you throw the ball around a little bit, get warmed up. And then they'll have you throw that 20-yard out. Bring everyone to their feet. Wait, everyone, you, you think there'll be a crowd? Yeah, I hope so. Football's no fun in a vacuum. Plus, the Jack Ford is gonna be there. That's awesome. Uh, guess I gotta go. Hey, man, if you're nervous, I can always go with you. I could ask if... Oh, shoot. You know what? I can't. I got a call last night. Unfortunately, somebody dropped out, and I have to go to that. Uh, what? Oh, what do they call that again? Super Regional Combine! Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> yeah. Crazy, right? Oh, Dallas, dude. two weeks. I told you, man. <laughs> I t Guess I gotta go. Who'd have thought, dude? Two guys from Mathis making it this far. This guy's impatient. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. Take your time. I'll tell him you're coming. Thanks, man. <laughs> Before you were born, this was my prized possession <laughs> for my perfect game in high school. A seven touchdown pop warning game. <laughs> I love that Colt had you autograph it. I know you don't remember much about it, but your mama loved you so much. Yes, you did it, son. You did it. So this is episode four of my long shot walkthrough. And we're reminiscing about our father before we are about to go attend this long shot event. So if you missed the last few episodes, make sure you go check them out. I do have a playlist. So let's get right back into episode number four. Your first big win. You bring the game ball home and put it right in here. <laughs> Love that. Welcome to Longshot. Ah, thank you. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. Can you, uh, can you back up a bit? Oh, you'll get used to that. Yeah, I ain't so sure. Oh, you will. Let's get you settled. Okay. What are you up to? You'll see, one sec. You guys ready for Devin? Yeah, up the ramp. Oh, ready for what? How could you possibly do this? Just, just... Devin, wait! I've waited long enough. We've been waiting long enough, baby. I'm going out here to see what this long shot is all about. We see the bright lights and we are ready for it, you know? You remember how we went to six regional what to do's this before we found Devin? Yes, and? You know what? I don't want to ruin the surprise.
please welcome the host of our show and legendary coach, Jack Ford. Hello and welcome to Long Shot. I'm Jack Ford, and tonight we're going to be introducing you to four quarterbacks, each one brought here thinking he was the lone long shot. What? But after scouring all six regional combines, it was clear that there were four quarterbacks who were worthy of starring in this show. They can't do that. Ross, you didn't. I did. I so did. Four of you will all battle it out on live television, all for the opportunity to work with me in our state-of-the-art facility in your quest to go from long shot to an NFL roster. You're going to be put through a series of tests where you can prove to me that you've got what it takes, and there isn't much time to impress. One of you is heading home tonight. I know you couldn't trust these people. You're just lucky they didn't want you. First, though, Let's introduce our long shots. The University of Kentucky standout who injured his knee his junior year. It's Tredarius Johnson. A backup at Wisconsin. It's Josh Butterly. A starter at Bowling Green, considered a system quarterback. It's Mike Schmizniak. And a freshman starter at Texas who walked away from football three years ago. It's Devin Wade. Now, I've spent the past week studying tape on all of you. And for some, this was a good thing. For others, it raised more questions than answers. And two of you will answer those questions right now. Josh Butterly, step forward. Devin Wade, please step forward. The producers of Longshot have given me carte blanche to cut one of you right out of the gate. But between the two of you, there wasn't enough tape for me to decide. So this is your chance to show me something right now. Josh Butterly, we'll start with you first. That's not what we talked about. I know. It's so much better. And how is that going to tell us who the better football player is? I leave that to you. You're back on. It's simple, gentlemen. You will now be tested on arm strength and accuracy. Avoid the obstacles and score as many points as you can in the allotted time. You have 30 seconds. Higher point total wins. Ready? Begin. So we thought we were the lone long shot in this whole show thing that he came up with, but he tricked us. We are actually one of four quarterbacks, and as you see right now, I am trying to beat out, what's this dude's name, Butterly? He is looking like a butterball. Did you see him? He looking all chunky, so what you have to do right here is basically hit these targets. The easiest ones to hit to me are actually number four in the corner. 
you put your little, you know, your target over there and you throw the ball. And also the twos and the ones now. You see I hit the fours and I am only one point away from beating this guy. So I'm just going to go for one of the twos and I get it. So you see we have already won and we only have 15 seconds left. Actually, it's going kind of slow, isn't it? You see how slow it's going? They want to make sure that I beat this guy. If you don't, I'm not sure exactly what will happen. I beat it on the first try, as you see right here. And I am still trying to get that five now. When I first played it, I did not know you could use the right... Oh, I hit the five! I did not you know that you could use the right thumbstick to move your target up and down. Because right now, I was just moving it around with the left thumbstick. But you can also move it up and down to make your the ball go a little bit higher. But as you see, I am still killing it. See right there, I'm missing the ones because I was not using that right stick. But I ended up with 21 points. Let's get back into it. Josh Butterly. Unfortunately, your quest to be our long shot ends here. Best of luck. The rest of you, get some rest. Tomorrow, two more of you are going home. What was that? Ah, uh, that's what I like to call amazing television. They didn't name me executive producer for nothing. Vice presidency, here I come. But those guys had no idea. I know, right? That was the best part. Did you see the look on their faces? Hilarious. Don't doubt it. Oh, I'm blowing up. Spence, buddy. Did you hear that whole exchange? Did you know? Look, Ross... Ross knows what he's doing. Wade, Smizniak, Johnson. Today, we're going to test you on mind, body, and intangibles. And after these drills, one of you will be cut, so give this everything you've got. Devin, since you had the least amount of tape to review, You'll kick things off for us. Devin, welcome to the play calling assessment. An NFL quarterback must be able to call plays in the huddle. And I'm here to see if you have the ability to pull that off. When I worked with Big Ben, it was like he knew what I was going to call even before I called it. And that's one reason that he's so successful. Now, here's how it works. I'll call a play into your headset, and you have to call the play back to me in the correct order. Now, your ability to remember these plays will have a big impact on whether or not you stay on the show. Ready? Yeah. All right, let's go. Strong eye twins, flex dagger, X dig, Y shallow, Z go. What's the first part of the play? Strong eye twins. Nice job. What's the next portion? Flex, dagger. Good, next. X, dig. Next. Y, shallow. Finally. Z, go. That's exactly what I'm looking for. <laughs> so we're playing a little bit of Simon Says with these plays, aren't we? But this is pretty cool. Single back, ace pair. Y stick, X slant, Z go, U flat. What's first? Single back, ace, pair. Great, next. Y stick. Yep, keep going. X slant. Next. Z go. Finally, you flat, keep it up. Gun bunch weak, double trail, X go, Y dig, Z shallow. All right, last play, what's the first section? Gun bunch weak. Excellent, what's next? Double trail. Yep. 
X go. And? Y dig. Lastly? Z shallow. Well done, Devin. Good work. Well, that's the end of the play call assessment, and you did about as well as I expected you to. If I were you, I'd get ready for the next challenge. Hey, man, you're up. How'd it go in there? Shoot, man. I don't know. I think I did good, but that guy's just so tough to read, you know? Any advice? Yeah, if you don't know the answer, don't guess. Devin, come in. All right, man. Good luck, bro. Devin, have a seat. It's time for the football IQ assessment. Now, I'm going to ask you a series of questions that I'd expect any NFL quarterback prospect to know. You ready? What position is highlighted on the screen? Uh... Safety. Who's your hot receiver on this? He's right there. Okay. If you don't mind, I'll stick around, see if you can maybe try to match what I did. Whatever, man. Knock yourself out. <clears throat> Devin, hustle up. It's time for the field test assessment. Now, I'm going to evaluate your timing and your accuracy as you throw a variety of routes. Players like Aaron Rodgers are as great as they are because they know where to throw the ball and they know when to throw it. And if you can't do that, then you will not make it as a quarterback at any level. Got it? So we are back on the football field trying to impress once again, but this time we're going back to pretty much like the drills that we were doing at the combine with the target passing. And we are trying to do our best to get all of these passes on point, but that one, oh my goodness, dude. I messed up on the first one. I'm like, bruh, I'm about to get cut from the long shot show and I don't want that to happen at all. As you see old buddy over there, he's liking what he's seeing. He doesn't want me to beat him out. He wants to be the long shot. So from now on, I'm like, all right, I cannot miss any more passes. That one is going to be on point. And you see what every single pass, my scouting report is changing. Now, like I said before, you can pause the game at any time and look at your scouting report. It will tell you exactly what your grade is, all of that great stuff. This right here is easy, an easy pass. Across the middle of slant, you know that's what we like to do anyway. So we are completing that one. But I think it's pretty cool now. When I get into the later episodes, uh, I did play through long shot about three times. I'm not even going to lie to you. <laughs> so this right here is actually the first time that I played through it. So I figured out what you have to do to actually, well, I can't tell you right now. I don't want to ruin the story, but there's ways that you can change the story and I might show you a couple alternate endings. We shall see. Let's get right back into the story. We did our thing out here. Now that the assessments are complete, it's time for me to sit down and carefully evaluate each of you on tape. There's some good. And there was a lot of bad out there today. I got a lot to think about. I'll see you tomorrow. Leave me a like. I'll see you in episode five. That nasty. Peace.